Thanks for joining us tonight. I'm Alan Van Zandt in for Mary Grace this evening. It was back in 2014 the City of St. Joseph's stormwater program failed an audit from the Department of Natural Resources when they were found not to be in compliance with their stormwater permit. Well, the DNR contacted the city again this year to conduct another audit of the city's municipal separate storm sewer system. And the city was found to be in compliance this time and said the city has a very good understanding of the different aspects of the permit. Very important for us to pass that audit. It was a pretty big deal. Um, if the city is found to be in non-compliance with any of our Missouri Department of Natural Resources permits, um, you can get the city itself could get really hefty fines. And so obviously we want to save our citizens tax dollars, make sure that we're in compliance and then also providing those stormwater benefits in terms of clean water, recreation, clean streams to be able to play in and enjoy for our kids and our future kids and our grandkids. City officials say they're looking forward to this next year and working with groups such as Beautify St. Joe and the Sustainable Advisory Committee to continue to make positive impacts.